commanders present here, members of the University Council, vice chancellors of other universities present. I've seen other chancellors, particularly the chancellor of Dedan Kimati University, and all protocols observed. Your Excellency, sir, I'm pleased to be part of this first graduation ceremony of the National Defense University, Kenya. This is yet another milestone in our education sector. Your Excellency, to put this into perspective, it is important to mention that the National Defense University, Kenya, was the first university in Kenya to be granted a charter under Section 24 of the Universities Act 2012. The university was granted its charter on the 27th May 2021 after the Commission for University Education was satisfied that it met all the requirements of a specialized degree awarding institution whose mandate of strategic and national importance. Accordingly, the university was mandated to focus on training and capacity building on practical realities of Kenya's national security concerns and act as a ring, uh, as a think tank or a policy institute for government and other and over strategic thinking and direction. Your Excellency, on this occasion of the university's first graduation, I'm happy to see that the university has achieved its mandate and I'm optimistic that it will continue on the same trajectory. My ministry welcomes this growth and the university's contribution to the development of the country's high-level human resource on the specialized areas of defense, security, and strategy. As we celebrate this milestone, I thank all of you for the guidance and support, you, Your Excellency, for the guidance and support you have provided this university as the Chancellor. Equally, I thank you for the support you have provided to the means of education in general. As your Cabinet Secretary in charge of education, I am fully aware that matters relating to education are close to your heart. This is evident from the reforms your government has instituted in the education sector, which are meant to streamline the sector and ensure education opportunities are available uh, to all. Your Excellency, sir, also allow me to congratulate and thank my counterpart in the means of defense, Honorable Adam Duare, for the guidance and support he has accorded this university. On the same note, our proud University Council, the Vice Chancellor, and the entire university management, as well as faculty and the staff uh, of National Defense University Kenya, for their tireless efforts which have definitely contributed to the achievement of this milestone. Your Excellency, on my part as the Cabinet Secretary for Education, I commit continued support to the university. However, I am aware that the resources allocated by the government, by your government, may not uh, be sufficient all the time to support all university programs, especially research projects, and therefore, call upon the university's management to develop innovative programs to generate extra funds. On the same note, I urge them to maintain high standards of professionalism, academic programs, and the quality of graduates, as well as research and innovation. Your Excellency, as I conclude, I congratulate the graduates and I take this opportunity to encourage them to uphold the ethical values acquired from this university. As graduates of this university, you are now the ambassadors of this great institution. Step out there and diligently serve humanity. Always remember the just, that just doing good is not and will never be enough. Achieving impact is what counts. Become creators of the future. I thank you and God bless us all. Your Excellency, I now invite my colleague Adam Duare, Cabinet Secretary Means for Defense, to make his remarks and, my, and invite Your Excellency 
for your remarks and words of wisdom. Honorable Duarte, please. Thank you. <clears throat> your Excellency, Dr. William Ruto, President of the Republic of Kenya, Commander-in-Chief of the Kenya Defense Forces, and Chancellor of the National Defense University,